Hey everyone, just wanted to give you a quick update that the summer research program at ISER Mohali has been recently launched and the last day of application is 12th of May 2022. Uh, you have to fill this online application form and uh, there are some relevant information that you need to provide in that uh, application form. So like for example, you need to add the statement of purpose and a lot of other things. Okay. So uh, I have made videos related to statement of purpose, how to write what exactly it is. Uh, I will give you the link to all relevant videos down in the description box. So make sure that you check that out. Now coming to the summer research program, like I said, the last date is 12th of May and uh, the summer program is between uh, June uh, 1st to 27th July 2022 so it's uh, it's a program for eight weeks uh, like maximum you can have is eight weeks and uh, minimum is one month okay now whatever the case may be of course uh, it depends on the grades the statement of purpose and a lot of other things but uh, I just want to clear it out right now that the networking matters so if you have your faculty member, for example, knows any of the faculty members uh, from ISER Mohali. Okay, like for example, if you're applying for the chemistry department, so if your faculty members, any one of your faculty members knows someone in ISER Mohali, make sure uh, you tell them that you are interested in the internship and if they could contact their, you know, known persons. For example, if I am uh, I am your faculty member and I know someone nice in Mohali. So if you come and tell me that you are interested in this internship, I might be able to contact my friend or my colleague at ISA Mohali and tell them that one of my students is interested. So networking does matter over here, right? So make sure if you, of course, you have to fill the application form, no doubt about that, but make sure you, if you have any contacts, you, uh, you know, utilize it. Um, anyhow, so. Uh, the program will have a research component and also it will have a series of lectures that will be delivered by the scientists uh, at ISER Mohali and uh, in the, at the end of the internship you will have to provide some sort of a uh, like you know a, a sort of a thesis okay a small thesis related to your summer project okay now if I talk about the funding or the uh, or how you will like how you support yourself financially because this is not an online program so uh, if you, if there are three categories that they have divided into so is one is category a that is students having their own scholarship then there's category B okay I will just show you uh, when when we click on the online form what all is required so if you are a category if you uh, like the category B, B students will also be financially supported by the faculty members. So basically what they have mentioned that in the application form, certain faculty members will have a star mark. OK, so those faculty members will have some kind of funding so they can definitely fund you. OK, they can fund your internship. Um, so I'll show you which faculty members have the star mark and then there's category C students that is they would not have any financial su support that means for eight weeks when you are going to come here like for one month or two months you'll have to uh, you know uh, basically be independent like nobody is going to financially support you although they have mentioned that ISA Mohali will provide free of cost accommodation to students in category C so if you are in category B and category A definitely you'll be getting some scholarship or financial support so from there you can pay your hostel fees or, or your, your basically cost of accommodation but if you are in category C that means you do not have any, any funding then also they will provide you free of cost accommodation so maybe for food and all the other things you might need to pay but at least accommodation they are providing free of cost so that is a good thing right so this was the small update okay so this form will open up over here you have to enter your email id um, then your name your mobile number and your correspondence address and then click on next after that this form is going to open up so let's say you uh, click over here bsc if you are in bsc if you are in msc you can do that in which you year you are in like second year third year that you have to mention and then what is your subject or interest um so over here i have mentioned um chemistry and then your name of the college or the institute where you are currently then over here you have to mention your uh, performance record your percentage uh, or the grade point that you have achieved in your undergraduation okay um if you have done post graduation then over here you have to mention your percentage for post graduation also and this is out of what like for example if it is in cgp then you have to mention 10 over here and then you have to mention your grade point like 7.0 or something okay so uh, that is the whole purpose over here that whether this is in cgp or in percentage so if it's in percentage you mention the percentage over here and select 100 over here right 
then your percentage grade points are on a scale of again same thing which you mentioned for undergraduation the same thing you have to do over here um, any academic or research achievement uh, that you would want to mention over here you can do that and then go on next so okay a name of the courses subjects that you have studied are uh, during your pg or undergraduation you have to mention all the subjects whatever subjects you have uh, studied okay and then the name of the uh, faculty member from isan mohali with whom you would like to pursue a summer project so these are all the faculty members so there's a long list over here as you can see and you can see some of these uh, faculty members have star marked okay so the star mark basically represents that they have funding so basically if you'll be joining under them they have funded internships okay then your sop or the statement of purpose um for which i have already made a video you can um, click on the right hand side or on the left hand side and uh, and have a look at the video okay and then they are asking do you have your own scholarship or not and then just click on submit hey guys so i am a verified educator on an academy and along with that i am also available on the unacademy plus platform where i am taking live classes along with other educators so in case you are interested in attending the live classes you can subscribe to the unacademy plus platform using my referral code that is SETHI SETI and that will give you 10% discount all right and in case you are not interested in attending the live classes you can watch the free courses that are available on the unacademy for that all you need to do is go to the unacademy website or download the unacademy learning app and search my name over there that is ACT once you do that you will get the access to all the free courses that are available on the unacademy platform all right